Welcome back, pet of the week. Uh, we brought a mountain lion, a uh, cougar, a uh, <laughs> puma. Uh, what's the other word? Catamount. <laughs> what? This is a big cat. He is big. This is Fritz, and he weighs about 16 pounds. He has big feet, big body, big personality. He's just a big guy. Now, when you say big personality, what, what are you talking about? He is a big talker. He loves to talk to anybody who comes up to his kennel. He'll chirp and squeak and meow and tell you about his day. He won't do it here because he's a little bit shy. But okay, he, but he sounds like he'd be a great companion. Uh, yes, he'll follow you around the house and tell you all about it. So should we ask, it's a he, Yes. Fritz, should we ask his weight or his age? What's more important for the viewers to know <laughs> with this well, big fella? I'll tell you about both. He is 16 pounds, so he's a big boy, and he's also 13 years old, which is surprising because he doesn't seem that old, but he is a senior. So that is considered a senior cat. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what kind of a home? What are we? What are we talking? What, 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 what's Fritz looking for? Um, in the past, he has lived with dogs and cats before, but since he's um, up there in age, I think that he'd probably want a more calm retirement home, um, probably somewhere a little bit more quiet that he can just chill. As long as there's a lap that he can sit on and some sunshine to lay in, he'll be happy. I can't get over how big his paws are. Yes, he has huge feet and they're they're digging into my knee right now. So he's engaging, <laughs> actively engaging the claws yes, into your he knee. he is making biscuits with my knee. So how's life at Royce Hurst these days? How's everyone doing? Good, yeah, we have quite a few animals that are waiting for homes right now. Um, our biggest need right now is foster homes for both dogs and cats, but typically right now we mostly need adult dog foster homes. Okay. Um, so if you aren't ready to adopt right now, but you do need a friend in your life, feel free to come down to the shelter and you can take home a adult dog or cat or kitten or whatever you have room for in your house. Now what do you, uh, as, as a foster, as a potential foster out there, uh, what does a viewer need to know? How, what do you need to do to change your lifestyle just to bring an animal in temporarily? Is there um, much change? There's not much change. You can basically fit any kind of animal into your lifestyle. We'll match you up with whatever would work best with you. Um, but we take care of all of the necessary supplies and veterinary care. All you really need is some space in your home and um, just the the need for some companionship. A little extra love to give. Yes. I'm beside myself at the size. I don't know if the viewers can see the size of, of Fritz, but he's basically occupying your entire Yeah, lap. he's a big boy. And I'm a tall lady, so... <laughs> He is, he's taken up a whole lot of space right here. How long has Fritz been at the shelter? Um, probably a couple weeks now. All right, well, the time is ticking away, my friend. Yes. We're going to get you a home as soon as you know it. Uh, viewers, we do this every week, and, of course, you can get on our website, westernslopenow.com, to see the story, to see Fitz featured, featured this week. Say that quickly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but you can also go to your website, and you can view all the cats and all the dogs that are available for adoption. What's your website? Right, it's rhhumanesociety.org. Thank you so much for coming down. Fritz, high five.